Organ transplants in Japan tend to be ecological organ transplants. By that, I mean people tend to get organs from close relatives, such as parents. This means that the safety and comfort of the living donors are important considerations. This means that it's important to keep in mind how the whole hospital system supports these donors. Here's an important point. Most kidney transplant patients are prone to having complications. Some hospitals decide that they can't give kidney transplants to such patients. Our hospital accepts all these patients who were told by other hospitals that they couldn't be treated. This is a distinctive feature of our hospital. During an organ transplant, we are replacing one damaged organ. But for this operation to succeed, the whole body must be in stable condition. So it is important to manage the patient's anesthesia precisely. The Perseus and Smart Pilot view are very important for delivering this kind of precision. Each of these patients has a lot of different problems. So the most important key will be how the medical staff deal with the need to have full access to the information about these patients. New technologies will be required to facilitate the sharing of such information. In general, it's more efficient if we can handle the same machine for anesthesia in each theatre. Another advantage arises if there's an emergency. For example, if the lifeline is shut off, the oxygen cylinder at the back of the machine must be opened and used. In this case, if there are different types of anesthesia machines in different rooms, we may have concerns about how to use these different models. And as a result, we may be delayed in coping with the emergency. For this reason, having the same machine in each room is very efficient. One of the benefits of Perseus is the predicting function. It indicates how anesthesia develops when changing anesthetic dosage or oxygen concentration. We could see only actual anesthetics concentration data on the anesthetics gas monitor. But Perseus can reflect the vaporizer's settings and calculate the data automatically. We can see how much the anesthetics concentration will be and how many minutes later. It is therefore very helpful for us when we are planning. So I think Perseus and other devices that are suited for the low flow have made prediction more efficient and accurate. I think that has made general anesthesia safer. What kind of medical service we should provide to our aging population is a challenging question, both economically and medically. What anesthesiologists can offer is our ability to help answer the question. How can we provide total care to patients with chronic diseases?